So it seems like lately, Nancy, the display of the American flag has been targeted. I've just seen a story now of a grandmother now in Oregon who has been told to take down the American flag in her window or she is going to be evicted. A lot of these groups who want to put these flags up over the highways, in front of their homes, they're supporting our troops or family members they have in the military. Do you think American flags and the display of them are being targeted? I really do, Stacy. I really think our American flag is targeted. It's one of the last things that it's okay to pick on. Now, you're talking about 58-year-old Elodia Royce, and she had a flag in her window, and she was threatened with eviction by the Homeowners Association for her colored drape. Hello? It's the American flag? The American flag that people have fought and died for? Our American flag? They called it a colored drape and threatened to evict this grandmother? I, I, I'm in complete shock. That's really just the tip of the iceberg with attacks on the American flag. Did you know, Stacy, that it is considered by many to be a crime? to deface or hurt the American flag. Then, of course, it was deemed freedom of speech when people burn it. Um, I, I'm very disheartened. I'm very disheartened by the Homeowners Association there. Uh, I, I, I also feel that calling it a colored drape was demeaning. Do you think that people are not really taking the American flag seriously anymore and what it actually represents? Well, what concerns me is more from a legal or analytical angle, and that is if it's okay to burn the American flag, if that's okay under our law, but it's not okay to fly the American flag or wave the American flag, that doesn't make sense to me, Stacy. Does it make sense to you, little girl? No, it doesn't make any sense to me at all. Well, and I'm that's why I wanted you to me. sound off on that. Thank you, Nancy.